Hi guys. Well, I've got my Michael Kors weekender bag. Um, I'm getting it packed ready to go away for the weekend. I said I'd do a what's in my bag and what I can fit in it. So this is what I'm going to do. So at the moment I have got um, some two pairs of shoes, a pair of boots and some chill out gear and some underwear. I'll save you the embarrassment to see my underwear. I'm sure you don't want to see that. And I'll just go through quickly now what else I'm going to try and put in it. And it'll give you a good update on what's there. I'm going to flip the camera around. Just move it so you can see what I'm got putting in it. Right, guys, so I'm just going to start with um, a couple of pairs of jeans. They've all been ironed already, so I'm just going to fold them up and place them in the bag. And like I said, hopefully... I'm going to get everything in that I need to take because that was the whole point of buying the bag. Okay, so then a couple of more pairs of uh, three quarter length pants that I'm taking for nights out. Um, one more pair there. And now it's the tops. So I'm going to put the ones that I think won't crease as bad. Um, in first. A couple of more tops. So pretty much pack my clothes, up my shoes, um, chisel gear. Uh, some underwear that's mainly what I wanted to get into the bag um, as you've probably see in another video or it might be connected to this one I've not decided how I'm editing it yet there is a vanity bag that I bought which has put all like my brushes my straighteners my makeup my toiletries in so that wasn't going in this bag anyway because I didn't want them if anything ever spills or breaks it's all over your clothes it's not how I wanted it so pretty much Everything I'm taking has gone in this bag, no problem. So it is quite a big bag. A lot better than the other one I used to use. Don't think I'd have got much more in it because it is it is a little bit, but I've put quite a bit in it considering I probably won't need all this stuff that I've taken, to be honest. Um, but you just don't know what the weather's going to be like when you go somewhere else, do you? So you have to pack for all occasions. So, that is pretty much it. So it's got a bit of weight to it, I'm not going to lie. But I'm only going to be carrying it to a car, so it's not like I'm carrying it around with me. Um, and it's, it is full. Uh, like I said, there's a pair of boots, there's two pairs of shoes, there's chill out gear, there's numerous pants and tops. And there's also some chill out gear. I'm going to compare it, if I remember where I put the bag, um, to the bag I used to take with me, if I can find it quickly enough. Yep, it's there. So this is the bag I used to use. This was one I got um, from Benefit when I bought some stuff from them one time. So it is quite a bit smaller and it never fitted any, anything, not even half of what's already in that Michael Kors bag. Uh, really didn't fit much in it at all. So that one's at the back of the wardrobe. So that's pretty much it, guys. So that's me... Uh, so that's my weekender bag. Um, so yeah, all's good really. Uh, gonna put this here. And just in case I make this a separate video, I will just quickly show you the, the vanity case that I bought in case I do put it on a separate video because I've done a complete video just for this and what I could get in it. But I may join the videos together. 
So that's it for the moment, guys. Like I said, I'm off in a minute to Vista Village. Um, that's where I'm staying for the night in an hotel there and then going on to Essex tomorrow. So take it easy, guys, and I'll catch up with you over the weekend. Bye.